Nancy Lyons was killed in 2002. And to this day, no one has been arrested for her murder. Who was Nancy Lyons? Let's take a look at her life first, and then we will talk about her death. Nancy K. Lyons, born October 22, 1945. She had been as a professional nanny in the Louisville, Kentucky area for 11 years, and then in the Indianapolis area in the mid-1990s. And prior to 2002, for three years, she was a resident of Carthage, Indiana. Lyons enjoyed singing and reading and loved the outdoors. She enjoyed ocean fishing. She had a large collection of Boyd's bears. She was the daughter of James, James and Cleta. She was born and raised in Madison and was a 1974 graduate of Southwestern High School in Hanover. She was raised and was a faithful member of the Wesleyan faith. Like I said, she was a professional nanny and there are no mention in her obituary that she had any children of her own. Survivors include her parents, James and Cleta, and her sisters, Patricia, her Barbara, Beverly, and Deborah, brothers, Dennis, Donald, and James, several aunts, uncles, nieces, nephews, and cousins, and other relatives. On June 17, 2002, she came up missing. Her car, a 1993 red Nissan with license plate 39A 8348, was found running. The trunk open. She had a flat tire on the back left rear tire. She had been shopping at Walmart just prior to 11 p.m. She had purchased some prescriptions earlier that evening as well, and all the items that she purchased at Walmart were found in her car. It was just past 11 p.m. when her car was found running at the intersection of 700 West, near 500, County, 500 North in Rush County. Four months later, on October 2nd, 2002, a farmer found her remains in Bartholomew County on County Road 1000 East between 200 and 300 South in a soybean field that was 50 to 60 miles away from Carthage. Forensics say that Lyons died of blunt force trauma, a blow to the head. It's been almost 18 years, and Lyon's sisters feel that someone knows something about this. They have started the Nancy Lyons Project on Facebook. She was 46 years old when she died. Indiana State Police Pendleton District requests that if you know anything about her murder or disappearance or the car running at that intersection, if you saw it, give them a call at 800-527-4752 or 765-778-2121.